My son had been ill for quite some time, and um, when I came home without him, I didn't expect to come home without him, I knew that we needed help. Well, I would remember he, me and Evan would always, um, like, we'd always, like, do secrets, and we'd always, like, laugh about it with each other, and Derek would always be like, hey, what are you laughing about, or something, and he'd get all mad, and we'd be like, nothing, <laughs> stuff like that. That's great. I found out about the program through a gal friend of mine who had lost her husband a month after mine. And um, it was really hard because in Orange County there are no art for healing type programs out there. And I wanted to find a way for myself as well for Riley to be able to express ourselves and, and find a way that we could heal. And um, so art for healing was our avenue to do that. We make you express different feelings and make you feel different. You with the sad. Don't be discouraged, oh I realize It's hard to take courage In a world full of people You can lose sight of it all And the darkness inside you Make you feel so small I see your true colors shining through I see your true colors that's why I love you, so don't be afraid to let them show your true colors are beautiful. they do here they don't say like oh that's horrible they say actually that's great if you mess up they say no that actually looks great it's never bad it's just always great fantastic show me a smile then don't be unhappy i can't remember when that's all you laughing If this world makes you crazy And you've taken all you can bear You could call me up Because you know I'll be there And see your true colors shining through I'll see your true colors That's why I When they have a hard time communicating with each other, they draw a picture. You know, what I tell people is that everybody's colors are different. And, you know, there are many people, psychologists, that have defined colors. But in the kind of work that we do, it really doesn't work that way. It's how the individual feels, what the attachment is to color for them. When they put down a color, like a teenager who may be feeling a lot of anger, we often go through a lot of red and black paint. And so it's really contingent on, on them and not what the colors are supposed to look like. But I see your true colors shining through. I see your true colors. That's why I love you. So don't be afraid to let them show. Creativity for Healing has gone to amazing distances since we began. 
Right now, I'm overly amazed at how many people we've been able to serve. 18,000 people, children and adults, have taken our programs in these last eight years. I, I can't say enough about uh, the people that are involved in art and creativity for healing and uh, the work that they do.